In this video, I'll show you how to create a score from scratch using Frescobaldi. To do that, first click on this button here to open a new score dialog box. From here we have three tabs. This first tab is where you'd input things like title, subtitle, sub-subtitle, composer, and all that stuff. So let's input that now. And for composer, we'll put Mr. Anderson. You can put an opus or a copyright or even a custom tagline if you'd like. But for now, let's go to parts. And here you can select whatever instruments you'd like to appear in the score by default. And you can rearrange their order on this side if you'd like. So let's say I want an oboe and a clarinet. All right, go to score settings. And here you can choose key time, pickup, let's make this 5-4 with a tempo indication of insane. We can also change the MIDI output, version number, and a lot of good stuff here. So let's hit OK. And you'll notice that Frescobaldi has created all the code needed. Now this is a huge time saver. Don't panic if you don't understand all the code. I'll go over this stuff in a later video, but for now, this is a great way for you to get a head start when you're creating a new score. Now, one more thing I want to show you is templates. If you'd like to use a score or an excerpt that you're working on in a future project, you can come up here, go to File, Save as Template. And once you do that, you can then recall them from the New from Template option here. So for example, let me open up a new tab and let's create a new choir hymn from template. You'll notice that right away it auto engraves it and gives you all the code needed to start working on a hymn. So if we zoom in here for a second, you'll see it's nice, thick, high quality engraving and you're good to go. I hope this video was helpful. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.